We've got some more guests coming yeah, in right now, haven't absolutely. we? Absolutely. Coming up next, what is the uh, longest-running crime series in America? Now, a UK version of Law and Order is about to hit our screens. Talking to two of its stars, Bradley Walsh and Jamie Bamber. I'm not going to show. We're going to pop them. <laughs> one can go there. One can go here. Uh, in a few minutes' time, but let's uh, see them in action first. Well, we like to make our guests work for a living. So, if Mr. Bradley Walsh and Jamie Bamber right, could just come like in, just, just stick it down there, Sandra. Just great. put it down here. Yeah. Thank you. Oh, I love her. That's great. Bradley, do you want? Uh, we got the yeah, table perfect. and all, love. Where do you want that? You, you got, take you got a seat? I will. I've got some. Uh, we got, you can bring the very man back. <laughs> that's it. Where's the tea? Do you not bring the tea? No, I did, actually. Yeah, yeah. Go on. Oh, oh that's your. Oh, we nice. should knock off for a cup of tea. Yeah, that's it. Put your feet up, Sam. We can't have that as well. I hope you didn't put your back out. All right? Yeah, yeah good, yeah. Parts, Parts going good, a bit. Good, good, yeah. good. Go on. It's heavier than it looks. Control, Dave, it is heavier than it looks. It's not like here. <laughs> <laughs> it's much more. It's very, very nice sofa, isn't it? Good to see you both. Thanks so much for coming on. Thanks for having us. Yeah, no, it's great to see you. And um, you're behaving now. Yeah. What are you doing? <laughs> I always get suspicious when you go quiet. No, no, I'm, I'm all right, love. I'm all right. I'm sitting here. I'm just oh, soaking you know, I'm up well. the atmosphere. Yes, yes. I, I get worried you, when he gets this serious. I start. You two are good mates, aren't you? So you've got to watch Mr. Ben. You know, but you? there's a, there's other thing that's happened as well because you've got a cravat on. I have. You look very stylish, but that's unnerving me too. He's I actually, know. He's actually taken to doing that recently. It's the second I time I've seen him in a cravat. He's got no, it's four. It's because I've become a serious actor. Yes, you have. I've decided to wear a cravat. <laughs> Many times I've worn cravats on the show. <laughs> <laughs> it's all gone great. But you have got a serious or more serious role now, haven't you, in Law and Order? How's uh, it going? Well, yeah, it's going very well. I mean, we finish filming in a month's time. The show comes out Monday, 9 o'clock, ITV1. Um, it's the Americans' longest-running mm. crime drama. But uh, and the franchise is over here, made by Kudos, which has got a fantastic track record. Mm. And um, it's good. I mean, we've enjoyed working on it, Jamie and I. Because Jamie was in, uh, he's flown all the way in from Los Angeles and Hollywood to um, to be in this. Because he was in a show called Battleship Galaxy. I don't know if you know that. <laughs> that was very good, and uh, which has a which has a wonderful following. I watched every episode of it, and it's really good. He plays a five-legged alien, so that's all right. There, there he is. is. Ah. You can't knock it, Bradley, because oh, actually, mate. Battleship Galactic. I'm a huge fan. Yeah. yeah. I have watched it as science fiction. It's got a massive following, hasn't it? A very intense following as well, I imagine, Jamie. Yeah, it's quite, but it's broader than your average science fiction following, because sci fi always gets the diehards yeah. to watch it. But we've managed yeah. to sort of break out beyond that a bit. But yeah, yeah, yeah. When yeah. I was in the Wheel of but Fortune. I know. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know if that's got anything to do with it. You did a car comp. <laughs> yeah, yeah, car comps on GMTV all them years ago, wearing the old dodgy sheepskin with a cat. Yeah. That is, but it's good. and, and it's a, So, uh, what Jamie brings to our show is a massive following from that as well. So mm. Because, I mean, Battlestar is a big, 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 big show. So. But for me, it was a thrill to come home and to bring something. And, and have an English accent. Go and to have an English accent, accent, yeah. yeah. Mm. Although I'm a bit more middle class than Mr Devlin. <laughs> so I have to sort of take the edge off a bit. Tweak it down. Yes, a little bit. Has Bradley been giving you some help with that? <laughs> yes, I have, indeed. <laughs> no, he just teases me for being Dick Van Dyke-esque. <laughs> <laughs> That's so cruel. That's it is. so cruel. <laughs> Legit, no, I, I had a line the other day, didn't I? It was like, chitty, chitty, bang, bang. And yeah, you were chitty. like, he was cracking up off camera. <laughs> yes. Yes. And I felt chitty, like chitty, such chitty, a fraud. Bang, bang. <laughs> chitty, chitty, bang, bang. Chitty, chitty, bang, bang. Oh, you what, what? <laughs> I felt the fraud. Oh, no, it's good. It's, listen, we have good fun. We have good fun on the show. And it is what it is. I mean, Dick Wolf is a bit of a, mm. a genius in uh, televisual terms and a, and a legend. So Televisual terms. Televisual terms so, and film terms. So he, he gives the franchise to Kudos. Kudos make it. And uh, we, I'm very pleased and proud to be part of it. It, actually and we have a great time we have a great all right leave it love <laughs> and we have a and we have we have a great time we have a great time on the show and it is a good show it and is. we saw actually a big clip of it uh, in the last hour and it looks mm. looks compelling viewing and of mm. course it's huge i mean it's a giant of a of a series in america isn't yeah. it? i think it's the longest running series of its kind over there so you've yeah. got some big boots to fill haven't you yeah there's a lot of pressure i don't think it's ever happened that we've actually in britain got to remake an mm. American product. Yeah, they've Usually done just they, buy it in, don't they? exactly since Alf Garnet coupling uh, the Office. You know, there's been a massive uh, conveyor belt of talent from here going over there, but we've never done the same in reverse. So it's it's revenge. Yeah. Quite right too. <laughs> it is revenge. Yeah. And do, is it very realistic? Did you have to learn all about kind of the world of policing and coppers and stuff in order to get that kind of performance? I did a fair bit. I rode yeah. around in a squad car with some boys in uh, Waterloo. Arrested a few people? Went down CID. We did. Did you? Cool. For traffic offences, though. I felt no. like really, like, let them off. Yeah. And I think I did. I got one kid off. He was going to get his bike impounded and crushed or something. <laughs> and he was a painter decorator doing, doing his best. And I, I thought, no, go on, give the kid a break. Anyway, I guilted them into letting him go. Nice. Well, now, I, I like the parting as well. 
I know, yeah. <laughs> Sophisticated look. It is, it is. But listen, they, I, needed to, I needed to look different from other characters I've played. And so, you know, I mean, this guy is in his, he's an ex-recovering uh, alcoholic and he's, um, <coughs> he's uh, you know, in his early 50s. So I had to, I, I had to do something. And I yeah. actually end up wearing my, spe my own spectacles because, you know, as you get older, as you'll find out soon enough, Shep, that your eyes start, start, <laughs> eyesight starts to go, going. love. Now, so Bradley, to do you think Jamie looks like someone that you might know? Perhaps? No. Everyone oh. says, everyone says he looks like Shep. Listen, here's the coincidence because people so. say so. you've got no, Brian. Is. You've got Brian doing your games, your things, and everyone says Brian and I look similar. But I, I thought he was. Yeah. I thought he was Brian yeah. Connolly when I showed up for work. No. Yeah. <laughs> but it's, it's my mother-in-law, Angela, who Thinks, says yeah. that, that we look similar. Yeah, I get it all the time. I so, think oh, I've been similar. watching that Ben Shep. He's ever so much like well, you. Watch this so, hi, Ange. <laughs> yes, hi, <laughs> Look at that. Who's who? <laughs> yeah. So it's you. But hey, you know, you can see, you can see the, the slight similarity. But it, I don't think you look the same. I really don't. One's a You're a very huge good looking Hollywood man. superstar. No, Thank say. you very one's, much. One's really posh, and the other one's really, really posh. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> but you played rugby as a kid. I did play and a lot so of rugby as a kid. so did I. I think kid. it's well, that. It's that bearing right. uh, that you bring. We're going to end this loving now, I think, aren't we? <laughs> 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 Thanks so much for joining us, Bradley and Jamie. We look forward to watching it tomorrow Monday. evening. Monday, 9 o'clock. Can I just oh, say hi to my girls at home, Isla, Darcy and Ava, who are little? Are they watching uh, it? Uh, it's camera that four, one. son. Sorry, mate. You're I've, never, I've never done this. <laughs> <laughs> Light entertainment, you never lose it. <laughs> OK. <laughs> if you could take the uh, well, sofa when you go, then. I want to say hi to all my fans out <laughs> there. Yeah, yeah. guys. On camera three. <laughs> Thanks for voting. Right, we've got to take a short break, because otherwise we're going to fall straight into what's-his-name a bit after us. Martin, Mark Hayes.